what's up guys welcome back to college kings yo it's been a while yes we had a couple videos come out since i've come home i'm home knock on wood no covid so we're good everything's good we're back to doing videos yo college kings 2 coming out april 14th let's go anyways guys let's get right back into it here we go alex what is that holy crap it's loud aubrey why don't you just knock like a normal person you're gonna break my window one of these days because I'm not normal? True. Clearly, what's up? I need to go shopping. I want to get some cute clothes for Europe. And let me guess, you need someone to carry your bags? Ah, uh, you said it, not me. But I was more so thinking you may want to get some clothes too. I already have clothes. There's always room for improvement, haha. <laughs> Funny, give me two seconds and I'll be down. Hurry, it's windy out here. Aubrey, what store are we going to? <clears throat> the only store go uh, worth going to lose. Now I know I'm not getting anything. Nothing there is less than forty-five bucks. I probably can't even afford a sock from lose. Haha. <laughs> yeah, it's not that bad. I'm sure we can find you something. Whenever I glance at a place, all the customers look rich. Pretty sure one guy walked in with a security guard. You know how rich you gotta be to have your own security guard. Haha, <laughs> just look around it a bit at least. And if you end up not getting anything, you can still help me carry my bags. There. And finally, we've gotten to the real reason I'm here. Ha, uh, again, you said it, not me, ha. Uh, lose. Make sure you get something really nice. Maybe that can take everyone's mind off you getting your ass kicked during mud wrestling. Oh. Ha, uh, hey, Emily's stronger than she looks. Uh, that was not fair, ma uh, that was not a fair matchup. You chose to fight her, though. That was before I knew she was Hulk Jr. <laughs> Excuses, huh? At least our fight was civilized, unlike Nora and Chloe's. It did get pretty intense. Those two have been on each other's throats for too long now. What do you mean? All they do is fight. Does it affect the sorority? Of course it does. We can't do anything without them throwing sly comments at each other. So what's the solution? You guys, uh, you guys could fight it out like we do, haha. <laughs> that wouldn't be good. It sucks because I feel like I'm right in the middle of all of it. I'm friends with Chloe and I'm VP, but I'm I'm cool with Nora too. It's just hard. I think we need to make some changes. I don't know what, but something has to change. Uh oh. Sounds like they need to figure their shit out. Yeah. Here, look. Which one do you think is better? Uh, that's blue? Uh, I mean... The white one. Good, if we do anything in Europe together, I'll wear this one. But I'm getting both, haha. <laughs> okay, haha. <laughs> Are you getting anything? Uh, sure. Why not? Yeah, I'll get a new shirt. Let me know how much I... What? I forgot to grab my wallet. Bro. This is why you should never rush, haha. Huh? I was rushing because someone was crying about the wind. True. Okay, good point. I'll get it for you. Thanks, Aubrey. You don't need to do that. Based on what you're wearing now? Yes, I do. Ouch. Alright, I can rock this. Let's go ring all this stuff up. Manager, what are you doing? Sorry, I uh, dropped my contact. What are you guys doing here? Shopping, obviously, huh? The real question is, what are you doing here? Working, obviously. At Luz, huh? How'd you even get a job at a place like this? I worked hard to get this job, so I didn't have to run into people that I know. Plus, the pay is good, so can you guys try to keep this to yourselves? I really don't want everyone knowing where I work. Okay, like, what's the big deal? Of course, I won't say anything. I wouldn't want to ruin that badass reputation of yours. Haha, <laughs> thanks. For sure, no worries. Thanks, Aubrey. Look at this guy. All right, anything else I can get for you, ma'am, sir? Uh, nope, have a nice day. You too, come back and see us soon. Okay. She's going to Europe, right? 
Hmm, I think so. This trip just got way more interesting, haha. Huh? Why? Agree? Ha, ah, it sure did. Amber's in for one. Alright, I know I was joking at first, but could you actually help me get this stuff to the house? Size, ha, ah, if I have to, ha. Huh? Much appreciated, haha. Huh? I'm thirsty. Hey, give me the bags. Go get something from the kitchen. Yes, yeah, spy, look at the stems is sick. Alright. Hey! Oh. Uh oh. Lindsay! I'll oh, be careful. I'm getting ready to clean that up. What happened? Size, Chloe and Nora got into it last night. They were throwing shit everywhere, and now I'm stuck here cleaning it up. What were they fighting about? I have no idea. They're always fighting about something. You're not the first person to bring that up. Plus, I think we all get a taste of the charity event. Yeah. It honestly, a fucking embarrassment. This isn't uh, what we're supposed to be about. Are all the girls feeling the same way? Yeah, pretty much. They honestly need to calm down. Hey, Alex, it was nice hanging with you. I would hang out longer, but my sister's getting ready to call, and I haven't had a chance to speak with her in a while. Oh, sweat. All right, sounds good. Sorry, I was hanging with Aubrey earlier. Oh, no, you're good. So what's the plan? What do you mean? What's the plan to get the chicks back together? I don't know, but Chloe needs to do something. She's the president. I understand balancing friendships and ru uh, running everything can be complicated. That's part of the job. Have you spoken to her about it? No, but others have. And? And we, uh, and we are where we are now. Oh. I don't know if, if, uh, I don't know if she's really the best person to be president. Here we go. I can see where this is going. Who is then? I don't know. What about Aubrey? Ah, uh, she's happy where she is. I wish I could be as content as she is. Aubrey's always just happy with life as it is. I was more like that, but I feel like I always need to be doing more. What do you mean? If it's bad I'm thinking about running for president, is it bad that I'm thinking about running for president? Like, I'm friends with Chloe, and I wouldn't want me running to get between us. There's just so many people that are unhappy with her. I don't know. I don't know what's best. You and I both. Heard about, uh, heard anything about the other girls wanting to run? No, I haven't. Most of them think we should just wait until Chloe graduates. Is that so bad? By the time the reputation of the chicks could be beyond repair. Next semester, they'll be preparing for recruiting season, and we don't want to do anything with his bad blood. It's fair. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. I better stop talking before one of the girls walks in. I wouldn't want to continue this conversation with one of them right now. Uh, I need to head home anyways. I'll see you around, Linz. I'll uh, see you. Cheers. Oh, we just changed shirts randomly? Um, Emery! Uh, he's a pretty deep sleeper, so I'm pretty sure we get away with it. Oh, yeah, they're going to mess with him. I don't want to know that happened if we don't. Emre, what are you guys doing? Kind of with the best prank ever. Best prank we don't get caught. Who are we pranking? Sebastian. Oh, nice. What's the plan so far? Staying up all night is step one. Uh, wait, what? We have to wait until he falls asleep. Once he falls asleep, we're going to drag him across campus in his sleeping bag. We'll leave him right in the middle of the college. Jeez. How are you going to put him in a sleeping bag and get him across campus without waking him up? See, that's the, uh, this is why this prank is so perfect. Sebastian uh, likes falling asleep to this weird fucking country folk yeehaw shit music. But it doesn't bother him while he sleeps because he's such a deep sleeper. Plus, he already sleeps in a sleeping bag because he's too lazy to make his bed. Cheers. So this is a revenge plan over him being a deep sleeper? That's a revenge plan over the fact that I can't sleep because he's playing that damn music. Ah, I get it now. So you in? Not for me, dude. Nah, guys, that's not for me. I'm, <clears throat> I'm gonna try and get some extra sleep so I'm ready for the trip. Ah, oh, come on, man. Sorry, dude. 
Hey, those guys are going to be in for a bit. All right. Getting ready for Europe. We're in the same clothes. Emery. Wait, what? So how'd your little stunt go? You see that? Weird. It was amazing. The picture's going viral on Kiwi. What picture? Check it out. Kiwi. Ah, someone had fun time last night. Ah, get wrecked. Sun's out, bun's out. Early in the morning to go streaking, isn't it? Spicy. Someone got balls. Ah. Oh, it's best training event yet. Thanks for all the donations. You got it, man. Sight. What are you doing later? Oh, boy. Cheers. Okay. He took his clothes off? Uh, no, he must sleep naked. <laughs> I actually kind of feel bad. Where is he now? Sebastian, man. Ah. 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 You're not mad? Mad? Why would I be mad? If anything, I'm fired up. You better watch your backs, boys. Ha ha. What about the picture, though? What picture? Uh, check Kiwi. Uh, pro who took this? That uh, wasn't us. We did the drop off, not the setup. It says at Caleb the Ape Boy posted it. That's the new Ape Pledge. Oh, it's on now. Caleb? Playing some Frat versus Frat Revenge. I am now. Too bad we can't help. Emery and I are going to Europe. Oh, don't worry. I got this. Perry will help me, too. I'll have it all set up by the time you get back. Speaking of Europe, we should get going. All right. Here we go. Going to Europe. Yes, bye. Oh. Well, it's nice of you to join us, finally. Bro, I'm sorry. I'm Riley, hey. As I was saying, we'll be exploring three locations in Europe. London, Paris, and Amsterdam. I expect all of you to behave like adults, since that's why you are... And even though there are some specific activities, we'll attend as a group. Your own exploration will be essential to make the most out of this experience. Miss Rose, while on the trip, please remember that all campus rules still apply in Europe. Does anyone have any questions? Are we free to ditch everything and just do what we want the whole time? Refer to your own judgment. I'll take that as a yes, haha. Alright, everyone wait here and... Uh, talk amongst yourselves while the handlers get your bags. Riley, Alex, may I speak for you for a second? Okay. What's up, Mr. Lee? I prepared something for you, uh, for the two of you. Okay. What do you mean? When I was in college, I went on a broad trip similar to this one, but to Asia. My professor gave me a map that apparently has some treasure at the end of you follow the riddles. Okay. What kind of treasure? There's a map for each continent... And while in Asia, I found this. It's worth a quite a lot. I've looked at the riddles, and I know three cities we're visiting each have a piece of information. But why are you telling all uh, telling us all this? Well, I wanted to explore these myself, but I won't have the time. And with you two being my brightest and most trusted students, ah, Alice must be the most trusted one. He's definitely not the brightest. Ha ha. Oh, ha, ha, ha. funny. I just felt I could trust you two with the task. Sounds super fun. Can I keep the treasure? If you find uh, find it, then I sh it shall be yours. Just make sure to let me know what it is. And if you need additional motivation, uh, you both better receive extra credit for this. Oh, okay. Now I'm definitely in. The most trusted student definitely needs some extra credit. Ha ha ha. I'll leave you to it. It's going to be so much fun. Ha <laughs> cough, nerd. <coughs> I'm sorry, did the teacher's pet say anything? Uh, so what does it say? Well, let's see. Deep in London, you'll find Mr. Duncan. Not at all luncheon. Uh, where gunmen go stunting. Many of targets be careful in London. A bullet is quick and comes almost too sudden. This is sick, yo. Okay, this actually sounds kind of cool. I'm glad you see the fun in this too. Uh, 
So it sounds like a gun range or something uh, with guns. Oh, it could be the thing where the screen pull and you shoot the little disc thing. Skeet shooting? Uh, yeah, but that's the... Yeah, that. But it has to be run by a guy named Duncan. Haha. <laughs> hey, Alex. Amber. We'll talk about this more later. All right. Oh, here we go. Chuckles, hi. Do you have something on my face or what? I saw you pointing, Charlie. Chloe. Aubrey. So what now? So what? Now he's keeping them all quiet? Oh, don't worry about it, Alex. Just having a little fun. I'd never say anything bad behind your back. We were just joking around. What was the joke? I want to laugh, too. It's funny it would just ruin it. Okay. I'm sure we'll have plenty of jokes together in the future, huh? Haha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Yeah, I wouldn't want to ruin the joke. Look at that. Even more when they, uh, we have in common. Oh, uh, yeah. You look concerned. Is everything okay? Yeah, what's your deal? I'm fine. Just uh, got some things on my mind. Well, we're friends now. You can talk to me whenever. Yeah, sure. All right, Europe. Here we come. What's your deal, bro? Lindsay. Aubrey. Yeah? What's that all about? Why was he pointing and laughing at me? I can't tell if he's being nice playing around or an actual dick. One of the girls made a joke and said, Who, Alex? It really wasn't that big of a deal. Oh, I don't know. Something about Charlie just rubs me the wrong way. It's facts. Keep getting worked up over nothing and your head may just explode. Huh? Just shrug it off. Like Amber did when I teased her. Oh, okay, you're right. Speaking of Amber, there she is. Uh, go talk to her and maybe she'll keep... Uh, maybe she'll give you some Charlie advice, ha. Huh? She always knows what I need to hear, ha. Huh? Don't tease her. Just walk in, tease her. I'll leave her alone. What's up? Listen, the real reason I don't want anyone knowing uh, that I work at Luz is because it's kind of embarrassing. It's not really my ideal job, but it pays really well. So can we please just pretend you never saw me there? Okay. No worries, I've already forgotten. For real? Thanks, Alex. Yes, bye. No problem. What's that all about? So why were you asking if we could do whatever we want? Sounds oddly suspicious. So that I can do whatever I want. Duh. What are you wanting to do? Kim told me the Amsterdam. Uh, Kim told me in Amsterdam there's some canals. And if you get high at night while looking into the water, it looks like the snakes in the moonlight. That sounds more romantic. Just want an excuse to get high, and it'd be cool to see it actually looks like snakes. You can come with you, like, ah, uh, you know, uh, no thanks. I'll pass. You're lost. Sorry, dude. Penelope. Hey, Amber, Alex. It's time to get on the plane. Later, loser. They work, and you heard? It's better than paying 15 grand. Miss Rose is taking easy on me. But Mr. Lee won't let up. He's making me do anything he can think of. He already had me carry all the bags with the baggage handlers. Speaking of, I need to drop these off. Here, let me help. Just glad this is... I'm just glad this is as bad as it gets. I'm sure Mr. Lee will get more creative than this. It'll be over in no time. Thanks, it still doesn't feel real how this all end up going. Told you I was a good lawyer, haha. Uh, yeah, you really were. Oh, shit. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Listen, dude, see? Still, still. Ah, uh, smirks. Sorry, but now I would. Let's get on the plane before everyone leaves us, thanks. Ah, uh, uh, okay. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the gameplay here. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe to the channel, guys, if you're new here. You guys have been blowing this series up, and I seriously appreciate it. Thank you all so much. Dude, this is about to get real. I know it is. I don't know, but I know this part's about to get real. Not going to want to miss it. Thank you, guys. We'll see you all in the next video. Rage and Rob. Peace out.